Hi everyone, I'm Vishnu Savraji, product lead from Google Workspace. And today I'm excited to walk you through a few new capabilities that I'm really excited about from Google Sheets. All right, let's take a look at this data set. I love tennis, and so I have a data set here of Grand Slam winners. Um, I think it has about 200 rows or so, and as you can see, it has about six or seven columns. So it is a pretty sizable um, data set that I'm working with. All right, I see a suggestion here from Gemini to analyze the data. So I click that chip, and just like that, I'm into this analysis mode with Gemini. You can see here that Gemini is walking me through what it's exactly doing. It's writing code real time to help me analyze the data set. It starts giving me some early insights about what it thinks the data set's about. So, you know, it's quickly realized that it's about Grand Slam tennis tournaments. There are many different columns. Um, it has about 290 rows. Um, it's starting to look deeper. It's telling me that there are only about seven unique tournament names. Um, it's looking through the range in terms of dates. And then it starts getting um, a little more interesting with the insights. You know, it's telling me that Djokovic and Nadal lead with 22 wins each, followed by Federer with 20. Um, it says that Wimbledon is exclusively played on grass outdoors. Um, it's looking through that last column uh, and it's showing me that the price money seems to go up by year, which is, which is interesting. And finally, it's gonna end uh, by giving me some further things I could look into with the data. All right, I'm asking Gemini now to just focus on the big four. So that's Federer, Djokovic, Nadal, and Andy Murray. Uh, you know, these are the players that I grew up, uh, grew up with. All right, Gemini's starting again. Um, it's showing me something interesting here. It's, it's telling me that, um, you know, again, Djokovic and Nadal have both won the most number of Grand Slams. But now it's going deeper. Nadal, he has a clear dominance on clay. Andy Murray's won twice on uh, grass and, at Wimbledon. Um, it's telling me about this Big Four era from 2003 to 2023, um, about a decade. And what's interesting here is that Gemini's uh, marrying what it knows about the data set with what it knows uh, from the foundation LLM. All right, I'm going to now challenge Gemini to create a visual to help me describe the Big Four era of you know, Nadal, Djokovic, Federer, Andy Murray. I want the chart to actually kind of go into more detail around what type of core types each player specialized in. And so I'm asking Gemini to plot um, years on the x-axis, player's name on the y-axis. And I want the colors of the court wins to be different. So clay would be red, grass courts would be green, and hard court wins would be blue. I think that with this type of chart, it's going to help me really just convey you know uh how each player maybe was was good on a specific surface and again I don't, I don't think i would be actually be able to do this manually in sheets so let's see what gemini does it's done exactly what i wanted that, that is pretty incredible you can see very quickly that andy murray you know specializes on grass courts and adal he has uh, a specialty on clay courts 